Hello, today I'm at my parents' house again. Wow, again? Yes, again, because, well, the ladies aren't home, so it's a men weekend. I've actually been there since Monday. Today is Wednesday, tomorrow's Thursday, and you're probably wondering, whoa, where's your little sister? In the basement. I'm just joking. <laughs> She's not in the basement. Okay, why would I say that? I don't know. Okay. Anyway, so what are the plans? Well, considering that the weather, as you can highly likely tell, isn't the most fantastic at the moment, I do have some really cool video ideas while I'm here now. Today is, th is Wednesday, tomorrow will be Thursday, and uh, as you guys know, there's not a lot to vlog. My step has been repaired because my step yesterday was, well, I wouldn't want to say broken, but two days ago had a bit of a, uh, a bump in it, so it needed some air in it. My dogs are being autistic as per usual, just like I am, but my dad is currently at work. Uh, I have some really cool ideas coming up for you guys, and uh, if you have any ideas, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, yeah, a little bit of a vlog, I suppose. You know, got the dogs here. Hey, Kaya. Hey, Belle. So that's pretty cool. My back hurts. Uh, I don't know why it's hurting at the moment. It's really painful, but uh, you guys didn't see me to love the vlogs. Very, very glad you guys are loving the vlogs. Me too. I'm gonna just keep it buck. I need to make some coffee. Cappuccino. The vitamins. So I've actually also got some leftover food from an ear. Some of you, I'm not sure when this video is posted or will be posted because me and my dad, well, well in two days it's Friday, and uh, me and my dad have been thinking of staying at my place um, because why not just chill week? But um, yeah, I got some leftover food here. Got some chili cheese nuggets, onion rings from last night, some fries, and I think I've got a burger as well, if I'm not mistaken. So this is the bizarre thing. You guys know Netflix, right? I, th I think a lot of people know what Netflix is, uh, but this has been going viral lately uh, called Squid Game. I've been watching it since last night, and uh, wow, it's fucking good. I don't even care that it's... Uh, Korean, Japanese, one of the two. Uh, I know it's Asian, so that's a fact. We do not discriminate in this household. But um, it's really cool, and I can understand why this took more than a decade to make. Um, really, really cool. But yeah, I got my food here. I actually have my coffee here. I, uh, I don't normally drink cappuccino. I actually don't normally drink, but you know. It's a different story, but yeah, on your rings. Not bad. I'll be honest, I uh, haven't really been feeling happy the past couple of days. Uh, it's been bothering me, actually, a couple of days. And I want to actually kind of apologize to this individual in my neighborhood. Um, you, you guys know, right? I like my privacy. I really do. Uh, but I'm also a person who likes to talk once in a while. Right? I'll be honest, sometimes I'm like, okay, yeah, I don't mind talking. Um, yeah, basically, it was my fault, yeah, because the people in this neighborhood are really, really friendly. See, I don't have nothing against friendly people. I really do like friendly people, better than grumpy people, but I'm a fucking grumpy asshole sometimes, right? Through these camera lenses, I can be an asshole, man, I'll be honest. Was I an asshole? Yes. And it's no excuse for me to say that I was stressed, even though I was fucking stressed out at that moment. Not a valid excuse, Keegan, come on, but this one we are, obviously. Basically, I got upset at my neighbor across the street, um, who I'm good friends with. I don't have any animosity, no hate to him. Uh, but I just sometimes don't like it when people, sorry, I have to step over this, invade your privacy. Because at the end of the day, I look at it as, as privacy invading. You know, whenever you step out of your house, how inconvenient it is that your neighbor out of nowhere at the same time steps out of their house and sees you, you know, this has happened, this happens like literally every, every time, right? To a certain point that I'm like, right, this is fucking ridiculous. Now, I can't even walk out of my goddamn house without getting spoken to. And in my opinion, it looks and it feels like invasion on my privacy. That's the way I look at it. I'm not sure how some of you may look at it, but I feel like it as privacy invasion. I, I don't like it. That's why I have this closed 90% of the time. I only have them open so I can get a bit of life for the video, but um, yeah, I, I was very frustrated. Yeah, I don't know how to explain it, but um, 
that wasn't really nice of me. I I'll be honest, it wasn't. He didn't mean no harm. They never really do. That's the thing. I know these people don't mean any harm, but no, it's got fuck all to do with me being autistic. Don't want to use that stupid excuse. Um, I was out of line. Even my dad said, you were an ass, dude. There was no reason for that. I'm like, yeah, but dad, you got to understand. I don't like when I get spoken to every time I'm outside of my house. Whenever I'm on the back of the field with you, you and I can't even have five fucking minutes alone without someone talking to us. And some of you will be like, what's the issue? I like privacy. You see, I, I've said it before, if I want to talk to you, hey, I'll really speak to you. I will. I know I don't hate anyone in this goddamn neighborhood. No, I don't. I have no animosity towards no one. None of them to me. Maybe, maybe not. Who knows? You know, if it is, it is what it is. But um, yeah, I got a bit upset. And afterwards, I'm like, damn, that was a fucking ass of a move to be doing to him. He didn't deserve that. No one did. But I was just fed up. You know, because, uh, I don't know, I think I've just gotten used to the fact that no one bothers me in my place. You know, the way I look at it is bothering. Privacy invasion, but it's not fair because they've invited us so often to their house. They're really friendly. I want to actually make a right with him, but I'm not sure if he's open for it. I don't know if stuff like that can be fixed. I don't know. Um, yeah, my dad did tell me I hurt his feelings, which I don't like. I don't want to do that. That's not what I intend to do. So what do you guys think I should do? Should I come over to him and say, uh, listen, I want to apologize for my reaction a couple of days ago. Was it necessary? And it's been bothering me the whole week because it's been fucking bothering me the whole week, dude. I think it happened on a Sunday last week and it's been annoying me since then. And my own, yeah, my own actions has been bothering me, not his actions. Because he didn't do anything. He just asked me, yo, I need a strong man to help me with my bike. <sighs> What's an ass move of me? And I'll be honest, and I will accept when I do something wrong. I will tell you, like, alright, I've done something wrong, but uh, what do you guys think I should do? I want to make it up. I really do. Because I don't want to make things awkward between him and me. And his wife, you know. I don't want to do that stuff. You know. I don't want them to see it as me as an asshole, which, you know, I can be sometimes. I'll be very honest with you guys. You know, I don't want to, not, I'm not that type of person, but sometimes even I can get really pissed off for no reason. You know, some of you may be, may be like, yeah, I understand it. Yeah, it's yes and no. But, uh, yeah, I need to know what you guys would do in this situation. Do I go to them and say, listen, I am really, really sorry. Uh, it's been bothering me this whole week and I really did not mean to hurt any of you guys. Um... But yeah, now anyways, since that is over, your boy is going to watch Squid Game Netflix. Oh, awesome, awesome series. I got my brekkie here, basically. Mmm. -hmm. Yeah, plant-based. Hey, how nice is that? So, uh, yeah, I'll check out later when uh, I got something to do in the house because it's raining today. Alright, so I just finished cleaning the entire house because my dad asked me, yo, could you maybe clean the house? Of course I can. This is a cream ginger sparkling lemonade of Fernandez. Uh, I think this is actually a Suriname's brand. So shout out to them. I think, yeah, I think it actually is. It's really good stuff. Ain't really healthy, but you know, it is what it is. Very refreshing though, but um, what have I been doing? Binge watching Netflix. Uh, like I say, you know, I don't really do a lot when I'm at home. Uh, why? Because I do a lot in my, in my place. Uh, I'll be honest with you guys, haven't done a lot this week. I have been recording a couple of videos, but um, for the rest, been really fucking tired. I got there, when I say I'm tired, I have been, for some reason, had no energy this week, not wanting to do a lot. But um, yeah, my dad should be home in about, well, it's one o'clock right now, so he should be home around five. 5.30, that's when he normally comes home, he's with the car, because he did, uh, this is his second spare keys for the Jeep, and he's got a bike helmet, which, let me show you how big this thing is, this is his helmet, it's a shoey, now people that drive bikes know how fucking expensive helmets are, I have a suit as well, I don't think it fits me no more, but uh, yeah, my dad has a BMW bike, which is really, really cool, the thing is fast, I think 115 horsepower, uh, which is quite 
quite fast for an old bike. Well, it's only four years old, but yeah, I'm gonna go continue binge watching Netflix and I'll uh, see you later when he arrives. Baboon! Shit's disgusting. Papao Morocco! I don't think it's Moroccan. Papao! Mexico! I bet it's as fake as fluff. Don't touch the bald spot. It <laughs> costs money, man. Don't touch that you gotta pay, fool. Anyways, I told you I'm gonna make some food right now. How's the cars, yours? Lekko. Alright, got some. Uh, I'm gonna show you what it is. Triple cheese, everything. Let's do this. Mm -mm -mm. Bit of salt, bit of garlic powder. That's really good. Melted cheese, fried egg, yellow soft, sunny side up, cheesy, tangy. Mm. Is that mayonnaise? And I put some uh, mayo in between there. That looks good. That gives a good bite, eh? That's really good. Look at that. Mm. That's a good snack, dude. Oh, that is, that is good snack. Can imagine uh, being stoned and eating that. Wow. Mm. That's a good combo, But the munch is going to be good stuff. <laughs> Weirdo. <laughs> A very good morning. Today is Thursday, I think. Yes, today is Thursday. Sort of getting ended up on the end of this vlog, I suppose you can say. Today is actually really good weather. Very strange, but that can always change. But uh, yeah, I just woke up. It is 9.20, no, yeah, 9.27 in the morning right now as I'm speaking. I'm still home. Yes, today is Thursday. And today will also be the day that this vlog will be posted. So that's really, really nice. Uh, my dog's fucking retarded. I don't know what they're doing. We have one special guest here though. Let me show you. And I don't think you guys have seen her in a while. She always goes outside and stuff. All right then. This is some awkward shit, I suppose. You. You guys are weird. <laughs> Oh well, anyways, what are my plans for today? Um, yeah, not a lot because the stuff that I want to do, I want to do at my place because of the fact I want to keep up to, to track. Like videos for this channel, for example, they have to keep on track of my place so you guys at least know that, okay, these are fresh videos. Because I do have some pre-recorded videos you guys want me to post, which is good. I will post them. I am going to post them. I just want to see when. Because they're like fucking old. They're like two months, three, four months old. Yeah, that's how much I record. Uh, I haven't actually really done a lot this week. Well, I mean, I think I've recorded 10, f 12 videos. Not too bad, I suppose. Could do way better. Normally I make 25, 35 videos in a week. A week and a half, so that is actually way better. But the plans for today are, yeah, just chill yet again, because I want to record at my place, if it makes any kind of sense. My mom, and grandmother should be back tomorrow if I'm not mistaken. They sh I think they are back tomorrow. Uh, so I'll probably be at home tonight. But yeah, this is kind of the end of the vlog. I actually haven't had breakfast yet. God knows what's in the fridge. I don't know what's in the fridge. And if you're wondering, why is it so dark in there? Well, let's just say I like darkness. I don't like when people can look inside, but... All right, we do actually, I had, by the way, amazing cheese grilled sandwiches yesterday. Uh, let me explain how my dad did it. Basically, when you make grilled cheese sandwiches, right, you can either burn your bread or your cheese is often not melted, right? I've had that a couple of times. The way he makes it is, man, it's something else. It's really, really good. But now I have to get my ass into gear, get these goddamn dogs lined up so we can walk them just now. I will record one extra video here that I'll be posting tomorrow, a story time about why and how I went to London, what it was about. I don't think I've ever spoken about it in a full story, but yeah, thank you so much for watching this vlog. Uh, sorry if there's a lot of vlogging inside, wasn't much to do outside because of the fact that it was really bad weather for the past two, three days here. I sort of got my hands down, the weather has been dreadful here, so I'm really, really sorry about that. But uh, I want to quickly say that I do have a mukbang coming out later for you guys, a subway mukbang, which I actually recorded about two weeks ago, believe it or not. Yeah, I had that set in the vault, so that's really, really nice. But uh, yeah, thank you all so much for watching this vlog, and I'll check you all uh, later, man. Peace out.